What is going on guys? Spicy Cork here for another video. Before we get too far into it, I do want to say that I am giving away this titanium white inner cell that's on my car right now. All you have to do to get entered to win is drop a like on this video, make sure you're subscribed to the channel, and comment your Xbox, PS4, or Steam username down below, and we'll be giving that away at 250 subscribers. So let's get right into our topic of today, which is the new update. Uh, Rocket League has been releasing blog posts, I guess you could call them. Uh, I guess it's technically a blog. It's just a, on their website. Uh, but they released some more information yesterday or possibly today. Yeah, I believe it was today this morning. Uh, yesterday for you guys, actually. That's what I was that's what I was going for. But let's uh, let's get out of here. So they're. They're talking about the new challenge system. So we don't really care too much about the challenges, as I'm sure you guys can tell uh, from the title and thumbnail of this video that we are talking about trade-ups. So if you guys do want to read this, I will include this link in the description of this video so you can go read all this information. Uh, but basically, challenges are changing a little bit. You're going to have challenges that are only there for a week at a time. They're not going to be there indefinitely, so you got to get them done within a week. Uh, which is kind of cool. I I kind of wanted to add challenges like doing the weekly challenges into like the video rotation um, Because honestly, I, I like doing the challenges like I like getting the rocket pass stuff I like, you know leveling up whatever. It's fun. You know, it gives me something other to focus on than just the game So, you know, it's 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 a fun little add-on I, I always did the Fortnite challenges too. everyone always made fun of me because like they were like, oh, what's the point? But anyways, all right, so changes to item series and trade-ins so as you guys know, right now, basically you get dropped in the game every so many games that you play, you get dropped a rare uh, or a very rare item. Um, and basically you trade up five rares for a very rare, you trade up five very rares for an import, and you trade up five imports for a exotic. So that's like when we're doing the, the non-create very rare trade-ups going for the uh, titanium white octane those are the items that we're trading up there's i believe like 15 of them 10 to 15 to maybe 15 to 20 somewhere in there and then those imports are what we are trading up to go for the black dices so uh let's just read this real quick and then we'll kind of talk about it so rocket league is expanding the variety of free items players can receive with free to play drops can contain items from blueprint or previous crate series including everything from Champions 1 series all the way to the Vindictor series. This means you can get Zomba Wheels, Dueling, Dragon Gold, Explosions, Heat Wave decals, and so much more. Free items earned from challenges and drops can still be traded in following the update. Trade in 5 items for 1 item of higher rarity. Free items you receive after free-to-play won't be linked to a specific series, and these items can all be traded in together as long as they share the same rarity. Because you can receive so many new items from trade-ins, current items will naturally appear less often. So if there are specific items from that group you're looking for, say a titanium white octane, be sure to trade in your items prior to the launch of free to play. So this is actually pretty sick. So if I'm reading this right, which I believe I am, you can get dropped a black market decal or a black market goal explosion just after a game. And it's not going to be a blueprint. It's going to be the actual item, which is not, I mean, that's freaking sick. They've never done that before. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, that's that's actually nuts. So and then all of those free items, I don't think uh, it doesn't actually specify if you're going to have like the uh, so it doesn't specify if you're going to be able to trade up the exotics to the black markets, man, that was so hard to get out of my mouth. I don't know. I, I'm sorry, guys. But we will uh, apparently any rare item in the game, you can link five of them together. This is after it goes free to play all the items after that point. Um, any crate series doesn't matter. You can trade them up for an item of higher rarity. So because of that, stuff like the titanium white octane is going to be a lot more rare because there's going to be so many other imports. So let's see. New driver challenges. Players picking up Rocket League for the first time will see the new driver challenges in their challenge menu. Oh, okay. I didn't read this earlier, so I wanted to read it. Um, but... That's just how you unlock, I guess, these wheels, paint finishes, cars, uh, all that, all that stuff down there. So that'll be people that are just getting the game. Uh, they'll they'll get all this stuff once you unlock it. Basically, once you do these challenges. So that won't apply to most of us since obviously we're playing the game. If you're watching this video, chances are you play the game. Um, but yeah, we're just focused on this trade in section. So this is going to be um, 
I mean, d- did Psionics just break it? Did they break trade ups? Like, is it is it going to be better or worse? Because in my opinion, non crate very rare trade ups were not very worth it because there's only one item you can get, and it's a you know it's a white octane. I still like doing them, but almost all the time it was a waste of uh, credits or whatever item I traded for them. Like it was pretty much just thrown away because then I just traded them up. Uh, all the imports up again because I didn't get anything good. Now imports, on the other hand, I there's like 13 or 14 black wheels. Pretty much all of them are pretty sick. I like basically all of them. So there's a lot better chance of getting something. You know that's pretty cool. That's why I tend to do a lot more import trade ups here on the channel, uh, just because I like them. But now with the with the update coming out, which I believe should be out on Monday or Tuesday. With the end of the season. I, I'm not totally positive. I don't think they've set a date yet. But that's when the season. The current Rocket Pass season is ending. So we're all kind of assuming. That that's when. Uh, the update's going to go live. So I mean I'm going to do. I'm going to do one of each trade up video. Probably between now and then. Just so that I can you know get one last. One last trade up session in. In the, uh, in the old way. Before we go to this new. Uh, honestly I think it's going to be pretty sweet. Because you're going to be able to get so many different things. I mean, you could trade up for like, you know, titanium wise Zombas or maybe some, I mean, shoot, I don't even know. So much, so much different stuff. Every item in the game, essentially. Um, and I, I did, this did cross my mind as well. These items that they, uh, that they opened up uh, a while back that we thought were going to come into the like a new crate series or get updated in rocket league and i'm talking about the inverted pyros the holographic dracos the painted versions of like the scarab the dominus gt all that stuff that we thought was getting added into the game about a month or so ago i'm wondering if those will be added in as drop items which would be sick i mean getting some holographic dracos from a from a trade-up i mean that would be That'd be so cool. I, I think this is really going to... I think Rocket League really listened when they took away the crates. Because with crates before, you could... You know, if you opened five uh, rares from a certain crate series... From the same crate series, you could then trade them up for a very rare inside that crate series. So I think they really listened to people wanting that back. And they even took it a step farther. And they're just making it, you know, any crate series that gets... You know, it doesn't even matter. They're just all non-crate items now, essentially. So I think it's super sick. Let me know in the comments what you guys think. I think it's going to make, uh, like, trade-up videos so much more exciting. Um, I, I mean, there's going to be so many possibilities, so many cool things you can get. It, it, is, it does kind of suck that it's going to be harder to get, like, a white octane or, you know, a black dicey. Because those are, like, the, the staples of Rocket League. You know, they're... Yeah, you know you just you just want them like they've been around for so long in the trade-up world like that's just what you're going for you're going for the black dicey you're going for the white octane or any octane i guess but really the white octane and the black dicey are the number one things so i mean it does kind of suck that they'll be kind of hard to get but at the same time it's going to be new uh we can't be afraid of change you know the game's evolving we were going free to play there's going to be millions upon millions of new players which is going to be absolutely amazing uh for content creators and just the game in general i think i think it's going to be amazing I, it's it's going to be sick it's going to be sick but yeah guys let me know what you think in the comments do you think that they ruined this they ruined trade-ups or do you think that this will be better uh let me know and before i end the video i do just want to remind you guys i'm giving away this uh titanium white interstellar at 250 subscribers so currently when i'm recording this we're at 199 one away from 200 so we are super super close uh i imagine we'll hit it by the time this video goes live to for 200 and then i will be doing a giveaway at 200 subscribers as well i haven't totally decided yet it'll be a surprise for you guys here in the next couple videos but i will be doing one so be on the lookout for that and we will catch you in the next video guys peace